From the late 9th to the mid-13th century, Kievan Rus emerged as a cultural and political force, laying the foundations for the Eastern Slavic civilization. Founded by the legendary Viking leader Rurik, the city of Kiev became the focal point of the Rus state around the late 9th century. Under rulers like Oleg, the state expanded its influence, connecting trade routes and fostering cultural exchanges with Byzantium and the Islamic world. Kievan Rus reached its zenith under Prince Vladimir the Great, who adopted Christianity in 988, making it the official state religion. The introduction of Byzantine Orthodox Christianity had a profound impact on the Rus. The city of Kiev, with its golden-domed cathedrals and bustling markets, became a center of trade and learning. The Rus script, adapted from the Byzantine alphabet, laid the groundwork for the Cyrillic script used in many Slavic languages today. However, internal strife and external pressures from nomadic tribes, including the Mongols, led to the decline of Kievan Rus. In 1240, Kiev fell to the Mongols, marking the end. Fascinating fact, the primary chronicle, a historical record of Kievan Rus, is attributed to the monk Nestor, who compiled it in the early 12th century. This chronicle remains a crucial source for understanding the early history of Eastern Slavic 